Hello, lovely people. Welcome back to Focus Hive. Uh, okay, my name is Mahabir, and I'm working as a technical advisor with Microsoft. And uh, I have um, almost uh, 18 plus of experience in IT. So the other topic that uh, we can hear a lot of noise about uh, in social media, news, everywhere, right? White Hat Junior teaching coding to five years old kid. So I wanted to see what your views are because I have very strong views about it and I will share it now uh, and then you can also share. I mean, let's hear it from you first. Yeah, so I think I'm the one who was, um, yeah, so I'll, um, okay, to be very honest that I would say that I'm the one who actually put my daughter's name for the trial and I have attended one of their class which is good and so they they actually hired somebody and okay that lady uh, actually taught her um, i mean taught my daughter and she was like because it it was her 10th and uh, i mean her interest was also not that great so yeah so we we did not pursue further and um, so the story did not end there okay so they mm-hmm. actually shared a feedback with me about my daughter and that was good so she did a good thing and she, okay they shared a very good feedback and uh, they also told that hey so i think you should ask her to join or, or the continue this course because she she is creative and all that which is fine i said yeah because it is her 10th class and uh, she could not focus on that and i asked her if she can buy some time she said no she want to focus on her studies that's fine okay that was the first call i got another call i got another call i got like 10 calls Ravi, trust me, I got a ten calls, and every time they have they they were not maintaining what I discussed with the first guy. I I already shared the feedback, and now on the tenth call, I was furious actually. I said, mm-hmm. okay, what 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 more you want to hear from me now? I've already told that we are not interested. Maybe if she will take interest, then I will definitely contact you guys. But we are not interested right now. And Perfect. still they're telling no, there are like these people and still that, okay, that sales guy was like pitching very like pushy. anything. I mean, it, it was like very pushy. So I have, I, I don't know, they are the same guy who were, I mean, selling insurance before or they are, I mean, these are the same guys who are like selling lands. <laughs> maybe, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And it is just, they have got good English now. So they are like speaking good English. They are sharing their credentials that they have done MBA from this college and now they are taking call and they are convincing people to convert uh, to to ask their kids to join that. Okay, so those okay. things are like different. But I mean, what I feel is, okay, learning. Okay, if the learning. So, so the entire idea of mine of enrolling my daughter into this is because I mean, she is still exploring her interest and all. So I want to give her a chance that, okay, if she could like okay connect to this she would pursue further and yeah i mean if, if she like it if she take interest in that so she so that initiative will come from her it's not that right. okay i think she should be doing she should be doing hey, you do you do you do the programming so it i mean it should not be like that right so right. my thing is okay you can yeah you can just check your uh, you can check your kids interest and i mean i would say that not to not to a five years old not to, and yeah so that pretty much i mean that'll yes. be like too much so that'll be too much yeah. so the first thing is because my daughter is uh doing um, uh, this like online classes for some time now and i could feel that i mean so when she take the class and she she been staring on the screen for like uh four five hours straight i she she actually take a nap directly because I, I, I could totally understand that because she already has that pressure and we because these these radiations are not good for sure right right but okay so and if you are not interested we are pushing you for that which is like even worse so I mean that is. is I mean that is my first take so you you should not be pushing if your kid is really interested if you your kid is like okay really inspired by the ads that they are seeing if he want to do it yeah I mean, yes, definitely. You can take a trial if he. I mean, if he says that, hey, I also want to learn. You can take a trial. That's that's not a problem. But once you take a trial, you are in a trap now, right? And they will say, hey, from the it's same like school, other students are. It is like policy bazaar. Or no, <laughs> sometimes no. Um, I'll tell you, Ravi. So so they are like they are kind of like 
I mean, creating some kind of peer pressure also. They are telling, hey, from Correct. the same school, same grade, these parents are also doing. Can you, I mean, shall I share your number with them? Can you talk exactly to them? Exactly my problem. Exactly my problem, right? So my take yeah. on this teaching five-year-old kid coding is totally absurd. Yeah. I mean, five-year-old kid, what all can their brain grasp? Right. I mean, how old is your kid? I mean, I know, but just for the audience. Yeah, she is fifteen. She is fifteen, and her parent. I mean, we have introduced already from Microsoft, hardcore IT guy who knows a lot of stuff. Has decided, went on, went through the curriculum, and then decided against it because the kid doesn't have that much either bandwidth or interest right now and when she would then obviously she will get registered and obviously the experience is not great with with uh, white hat junior but i don't have anything against the company right against the white hat junior company because i have not experienced it but the whole concept this marketing concept of teach your 5 year old kid coding is stupid i mean what are we going to get out of that isn't i mean the moment i hear it and when i see known people who i know are talking so convincingly about going for it that yes you should do it yes you should do it and as you've said right peer pressure i mean soon there will be people talking about are sharma ji ka laka to app banata hai tum kya karte ho right and the yes. kids will have that problem and the kids will say dad you did not enroll me in that i mean what kind of shitty dad you are i mean and i'll be like are main to tere liye nahi kiya <laughs> and it's like i could simply visualize things that has happened with us in past right coming coming out of school sitting with our friends sitting at home and suddenly one uncle will come and they inko english bol ke sikhao inko english bol ke dikhao say a poem and how if i would remember a poem i do i have that kind of culture at home nobody speaks in english dude nobody everybody is talking in some regional language and you expect the kid to speak yeah. in english and now what is what is going to happen is because of the stupid ads and people who are going to uh, run behind it like bhed chal are going to people who don't have one second or i mean minuscule idea of coding programming would also send their kids register them put money put pressurize uh, pressure to their kids to learn that and eventually it will happen as if we'll have so many kids doing uh, coding and do nothing i mean at the age of 5 what are you going to teach them print their names i saw no, the I, curriculum I, I, and they are talking about for loops and all that i mean your brain has to be that advanced to understand what is a loop yes yes ravi i'll tell you i'll tell you my experience i mean sorry for the interruption since you said they are introducing for loop i'll tell you what what they will do and how they will kind of like if they managed to enroll few kids or they have managed to enroll so many kids so i mean how they get them excited is they will open one canvas which is based on javascript they will okay write some circle code some circle moving here and there that's it and kids are like okay this is the game that i'm build i'm i'm going to build and so they they are not understanding they are simply so they are simply following what they are telling actually and um, so which which is like okay which they i feel that it it is not needed right now if you can teach them a very good physics if you can make a very good base for physics make a very good base for mathematics and uh, if they have got some creativity around that i think they would be like good enough to do the programming on their own they don't need Correct. those expensive Correct. stuff so since I mean, like i'm saying like, at the age of 5 at the age of 5 yeah. try and build a core of cognitive skills man think of that instead of coding <laughs> yeah no that I mean, is that is make your make your kids physically fit make them so strong so immune at the age of 5 work on those right so that yeah. your kid is Very super strong super healthy grows up as a healthy man or a woman and when their brain is ready to learn things which is really i mean gaussian theorem you have to solve theorems with five variables infinite number of variables you got to solve those to create a program digital aaj now you have to write ai ml codes i mean people are giving this thing that 
coding is the future you have to talk in coding language okay fine i'll, I'll we will talk in coding language but we will not talk in see out and see in print my name and print your name hello world we are not going to do that so that's where i'm i'm really frustrated with people genuinely smart people are talking that they will they they should put their kids in uh, this course curricula and get them enrolled and get them do all this but it's unfair i mean it's just same thing put your kid in a uh, convent school it's what we had experienced it's the same thing now they are going to put kids in to learn coding exact same yeah yeah exactly so basically okay whatever yeah if you go to okay may, maybe i'm imagining that okay from uh, hindi speaking um, reason and if you try to put your guy rather than focusing on the basic skills like physics chemistry mathematics you think that okay english is the only thing that right. if you don't know good english hey you you are not even a human civilized human you are you are some i mean somebody who i mean who i mean who should not be here so that is that should not be the idea i think they are trying to kind of like make a propaganda of like that that okay if if coding is not part of the curriculum it is bad which which i feel is not required and i think we all should stop this uh, so i can totally see that now they are slowly okay so because cbsc and the other uh, institutions they are researching and okay trying to slowly introduce to very simple like python into the i mean curriculum and so, i mean right. gradually uh, uh, like i mean to to actually match up with their mathematics level so they will slowly teach the coding and actually bring in them to some i mean some level but it is Correct. not it it doesn't make any sense that a five year old you will like okay uh, so i'm i'm imagining i actually want to see some apps that they have built actually <laughs> <laughs> i mean the I app that know, you uh, told me right they draw a circle and pull it from one side to the other side it is like two minute job on flash 5 which is like 15 years old version and uh, it used yeah. to you actually have to just draw a circle draw a line and then draw a circle and play the timeline and that it will do that you don't have to really yeah. learn coding for it and that's these what, guys that's what... are making people stupid by doing all of this yes exactly that's what they are doing so i don't know <laughs> and you and i or people who we know are all we are all our it guys right typical it guys we we have been doing this for so long but i'm i'm scared about people who don't know about these things uh, who have been in different field altogether and suddenly they'll realize that okay nahi abhi coding hi karna hai mere bachcho ko coding hi sikhana hai to let's put it and the courses are so freaking costly yeah the the courses I, are I super the costly in red eye jun white white hat junior so i'm like i was i was like wow this is really bad but then there is another point of view about their marketing uh, planning right their marketing is super amazing we are doing marketing for them right now just by talking yeah. but though we are talking negative but we are no, doing their marketing. any marketing any marketing is marketing ravi <laughs> is it like positive yeah. negative yeah so yes, they are getting yes. yeah they are getting trends so somebody is talking about white hat they don't they don't bother eh? are they talking negative eh they are people are talking about it that's it that is what they want actually and this, this is where they are getting yeah and this is what is happening so somebody all so people social like media guys, sure. right all all yeah. video creators like me will jump onto this topic just to get more views which i am doing <laughs> <laughs> see no that is that is also good yeah this is like good good one that you started and yeah this is no i i recently saw another video also some 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 another ad which is teaching mba to the kids so teach your kids <laughs> manage oh that. my god <laughs> so, i think I, i i will have to forget that my audience is like not used to me swearing <laughs> but I, if i hear these concept the real words will come out seriously i i think maybe i would have posted something against um, okay white hat and now i'm getting ads for that mba thing also hey post something bad about <laughs> this also na we also want to get trolled <laughs> right right <laughs> and and facebook is doing excellent job because i don't know why i am only getting it i told shweta shweta are you also getting this I said no, I'm not getting. I said yeah, I know why I'm getting because I was trolling for it's like white hat. Now they want me to troll for this also, so that they will get some okay, some marketing. Visibility. I'll repost. It's all about visibility, right? 
yeah it is it is about visibility so i think so their digital marketing folks i think their target maybe some some negative uh, uh, some negative trolling those guys only start and then mm-hmm. for them hey so you want like okay you want the, these topics to be discussed in like okay uh, these are the trends right so they actually mm-hmm. don't bother is it like negative positive hey well, uh, we, we we just don't care so they have to, and people have started talking about it So everyone, is, everyone. I'm, I think it's you know, it's 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 like a wildfire. Uh, something that was back back two three months back, there was TikTok, face uh, YouTube fight. It's gonna be like that only. That's All right. right. Good discussion so far. I mean, uh, I think I've shared the view that I had on this wildfire junior. I I mean, anybody that I know, I would say, not five years old. Come on. I mean, give your kids some time to build themselves. And there is time. There will be enough time to learn coding. computers will get uh, i mean will be there a su- will there be a subject of computers or not yes there will be a subject of computer and in that they will learn so don't force don't force on on them anything if they want it support them that's the whole point no, so, no there is a recent meme i have shared or i have seen it i'm not sure if you have seen it also that they are asking 5 year old to program and asking 20 year 29 year old to make a team on dream <laughs> dream in <laughs> <and> dream 11 <laughs> yes, yes dream 11 or i don't fall yes yes, yes wow yes. yeah that's good <laughs> india <laughs> india is awesome funny <laughs> <laughs> that's super yeah. funny no you you imagine so we are producing almost 26 lakhs of engineers right and they are learning computers for 4 years straight nothing else right and right. still they think right. that okay they will start teaching them so, okay where we i don't know what what we'll do with that so first thing is yeah those understand. guys would not be able understand. to cope up yeah we will be destroying actually so this so we already yeah. have good, i mean enough subjects they have to cover and the most important thing i guess people are not understanding is in order to program right in order to program in order to code write a program people have to understand how the systems work how the operating system work how which command you are going to pass on to kind of Correct. send that signal how to trap the keyboard all those they have to know before they start coding website bana liya is not programming website to write right today drag and drop kiya to 10 website 10 din mein banda so yeah. that's not programming if you really want them to go into programming and become mark zuckerberg and develop another facebook they have to go in that in detail with right mindset so if you make them so they already have a good amount of curriculum to cover and then you are adding this one also putting some extra yeah. pressure then peer pressure so so yeah so you are not thinking about so when they will play the actual games when they will go out and play the games right you are just kind of like gluing them to uh, i mean to the machines True. True. so i, True. I don't Funny know what thing. kind of generation yeah funny thing is we've grown i mean middle age now and we've learned programming we've learned everything in computers we live and eat computers now yeah. still we don't develop apps right we are not i i think i am not able to develop an app though i have to if i want to do that i'll spend some time study some of the refresh some of the codings and then go develop an app but my mom doesn't know anything about computers right but she has been hearing about who that guy has become an entrepreneur he became millionaire she is like tum log kuch nahi karta hai tum log bhi kuch app banao na i'm like ha mummy banayenge banayenge yeah, ek I, din banayenge i i i heard the exact same statement from the same person <laughs> <laughs> yep yep yeah, so yeah. think about that i mean we at this stage and our parents and now what will happen to people who don't know about these things and then they will start having the same expectation from kids who are learning coding from yeah. five fake coding let me say fake coding from age of 5 yeah. maybe so, um, i don't know out of like 100 kids maybe like there will be like 2 3% of wizard kids those kids yeah they will they will learn it anyways you don't have to enroll so them to white exactly wo to abhi bhi abhi bhi wahi scene i mean if there, there are wizards there is one guy who was talking with that uh, I, i forgot that name but there are guys who are doing cloud computing and all of that at very tender age and they have developed yeah. programs for that developed developed solution for that so magical kids will always be there but giving They'll this argument there. that in order to get magical kid you have to prepare them now 
so i'm going to bash them like anything and make them become sachin tendulkar it's not possible no no it's not possible yeah that's yeah that's true you are actually you are taking away their out time so the time where they would have spent some uh, real time in like playing the real games <laughs> in like real playgrounds right. yeah you are the only thing killing. the only thing i think could be beneficial at this point is because of the change in the policy education policy right where they are going to include more more freedom instead of the old framework and stuck with certain subjects things like that because of that change probably kids would be free enough to choose these subjects early uh, much earlier than what we could right maybe standard 8 yeah. standard 6 standard 5 whichever class they would choose they would still have still be older than 5 years old right and if they are beyond 10 to 12 uh, it's comfortable i'm comfortable with them to go through those basic understanding of how to write a program how to switch on a computer how to type things like those are okay because chalta hai wo sab but you suddenly come and say no write an algorithm to solve a binomial theorem i mean what 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 are you expecting so with that i think i would i would leave leave this controversy with people who are going to take these decisions for their kids i i would give this benefit of doubt that everybody is mature everybody is intelligent smart and they can decide for themselves but choose to choose wisely for your kids understand the limitation understand their situation and take the decision yes so, so the final comment i would say that or the conclusion is yeah let your kid to come this thing from them so let let them to initiate this conversation not you forcing them or you are coming uh, you are feeling the peer pressure from your friends or your um, okay your relatives so don't do that okay if if they are telling that they are really interested then there would be like other i mean they would be like um, i would say the free versions that i mean where they yes, can yes. run i mean youtube has a yeah. lot of videos for coding YouTube i mean have like lot you can learn easily yes if they are really interested yes they can learn it from there as well and uh, with the like better education so it it may not be the interactive one but if if your kid is interested he'll he like take it up from there say thank you so much for joining us today and i'm going to look forward for more such session because very interactive uh, but we are going to continue to develop more episodes and uh, share with people